What if you could see what crypto coins the billionaire VCs are actually buying? What if you could do as the billionaires do, not as they say? If you could follow their moves, well, good news. We've got the secrets. We know what the mega billionaire VCs are holding. And instead of getting dumped on by these billionaire whale VCs, when they pump the markets up for those coins like crazy, which they will, you could actually get in early ride the waves up with them in this video i'll tell you what they're investing in quick disclaimer investing in crypto is risky and you will probably lose all of your money i also own some of the crypto coins being discussed in today's video including by having been a private market investor in some of these full risk and portfolio disclosures including all my venture investments down below let's start off with binance labs this is the venture arm of binance the biggest spot and derivative market in the damn world. The Binance Exchange, the impact, I mean, they're the big daddy of exchanges right now, okay? You know. They've backed many gems. Binance Labs has the venture arm. Magic Square, Woo, Celestia, Polygon, Injective Curve, Finance, to name but a few. And recently, we had a very big announcement from the Manta Network. They listed over on uh, Binance and many other networks. Big, new, exciting Ethereum layer 2, the auto stakes your Ethereum, provides native yield on the ETH held in your wallet, as well as robust ZK tech. And while not everybody got the best airdrop from them, some people did get some pretty nice rewards, and congrats on for those of you who did. But the next big play in the Binance slash Manta ecosystem could be Kilo X. Now, this is also backed by Binance Labs, and it's currently the biggest perpetual swap exchange on Binance's op BNB layer two and on the Manta Pacific mainnet. And here's good news. You can get this coin for free because guess what? They're doing a gosh darn airdrop. Here is what you need to do to be eligible get into an airdrop first fund a wallet either on op bnb or manta you can withdraw funds directly from binance to op bnb by the way keeps pretty easy or you can bridge over to manta using something like orbiter to get funds from ethereum or any of the other top layer twos to the manta pacific network next use the link down below in the description which is my referral link that will get you a 15 percent rebate so win-win here absolutely now what i'm doing personally my strategy i'm farming the kilo x airdrop i'm putting stable coins into the kilo x vault this will help me to farm the airdrop you can also be doing trades there's other social tasks to do like checking in daily and stuff like that that'll also get you points for the airdrop now doing all this will help you get points that all counts toward that future airdrop Manta got listed on Binance, and it would not be a stretch of the imagination to see this Binance Labs backed Manta network coin also hit a Binance listing in the future. The second VC firm to look at is Paradigm. Now, these guys have nailed all sorts of early gems, Blur, Maker, DYDX, Optimism. Of course, everybody's talking about Blast these days, a big Manta competitor. Their next big money maker, though, probably going to be StarkNet. This is potentially one of the most hyped Ethereum layer twos, maybe after Blast. Uh, debatable, I guess. But StarkNet's going to be huge. It's coming to the market soon, although it's not trading yet. So watch out for a future listing. Also, it seems that the airdrop has probably already had the snapshot taken. So this is one that you're going to be picking up on public markets. Now, of course, there is no way to know for certain how a new coin is going to perform the markets. But StarkNet has announced that there will be a Stark token. That Stark token, they have said, will be usable for gas fees, which should create actual demand for the Stark token. And if we look at how new listings like Celestia have performed, then this could be an indicator of something to keep an eye on. Remember, Celestia is up 10x from listing price. Next, let's talk about Circle, which is the issuer of the USDC stablecoin. By the way, they also have a pretty big venture arm. Now, in the past, they've packed all kinds of big coins, Aptos, Sui, Maverick, again, some of the biggest names in the space. Now, here is some super early alpha. Almost no one is talking about this airdrop yet, and that is called Burnt Finance, and they're scion token now this is built for an abstraction layer so it's a layer on blockchain with a technical abstraction layer to help onboard users by removing technical barriers let me translate that for you they let people use blockchain without them even knowing that they're using the blockchain 
Now you see, of course, why USDC issuer Circle is actually working with them. Imagine if sending USDC was as easy as using, well, internet banking or even easier. Just, hey, send 10 bucks to dad. Boom, done. No blockchain BS, no proving contracts like a nerd. Okay. These guys are running airdrop, by the way, for early testers of their public testnet. This is happening right now. There will be an airdrop. Use the link in the description to get signed up. And P.S. Don't come back crying to me, guys, when you miss out on the next big insane airdrop. We've been covering airdrops on this channel for a long time now. We've seen some really big ones. We've all made some money on them. I hope you guys made money on them, right? Don't miss out on being early. If you really want to make sure that you're staying up to date on all the latest happenings in the crypto markets and to not miss out on some of the highest potential airdrops coming in the market, then you need to get signed up to the Wealth Mastery Newsletter link in the description where you can sign up for free and join our 100,000 weekly readers. Thank you. Now, number four, Coinbase Ventures. Obviously, Coinbase needs on introduction. Big daddy of exchanges as well. Maybe big mommy behind Binance. Hard to say. Anyway, they backed stuff like Celestia, Star, Instadap, Maverick, Optimism, Moonbeam, and many, many other big players. And there is one to highlight here, and that's Chainflip. Now, this is one we've mentioned here recently. But considering the addressable market, it feels undervalued still. Now, Chainflip is a native cross-chain swap protocol. I know there's lots of cross-chain swap stuff going on right now, okay? But it lets you swap from your Bitcoin over to your Ethereum to other major chains like Solana natively without using dangerous bridges, which have an unfortunate history of having a lot of hacks happen to them. Now, the main net's live, but it's very early days for this one. Now, I received my venture round investment and staked it for a year, as I think this will trade higher in the future, selling it now. I felt like would have not been the right call. So that's why I'm staking it. It's locked for a year. Look, no fancy airdrops here, anything like that. You can just go buy this one on exchanges. Stake it if you so choose. Number five, Pantera. This is a mega VC who once again has had their fingers in some of the biggest and mm, most delicious pies in crypto. Arbitrum, Cosmos, Injective, Polkadot. These guys are there on the ground floor for all that stuff. And what could be one of their most under the radar plays right now? Oasis Network and the Rose Token. Now, the current market cap of this bad boy is only around like seven to $800 million, depending on the current price at the time of this video. Not even a billion dollars. Not even one billion. But the potential is huge. Private transactions. You have gigabrain nerds like Don Song developing it. You know, those are the kind of people you want working on your blockchain. They're tapping into the AI market as well. And now we have an ecosystem about to pop off with new protocols like X coming on chain. Now, I've got a big bag. Currently staking, not looking to sell this anytime soon. Ideally over a buck, two bucks, man, that'd be fantastic. But hey, let's see what happens. Again, nothing fancy here. You just go buy this on the exchange, stake it in your wallet. Don't miss out on the staking rewards. Of course, if this is something you want to buy. Number six, Animoca. Now, this is a VC mostly known for their gaming investments, and they do have some pretty awesome ones like Axie Infinity, Sandbox, and these guys were super early on that stuff, as well as unreleased gems like Planet Mojo. There's some alpha for you, by the way. Those guys are working with Amazon. But actually, I want to highlight a non-gaming gem in their portfolio, which is Claystack. This is an Ethereum liquid staking protocol. Now, look, liquid staking is very popular. And early movers like Lido Finance are going to be hard to compete with. They're already so big and so powerful and so trusted. But Claystack allows for staking multiple different assets, not just Ethereum, but Ethereum, Polygon, Aptos, probably see more in the future. So maybe there is some edge there in that regard. And while the token is not yet released, the biggest competitors, they have some huge market caps for comparison. Lido, 3 billion, Rocket Pool, 700 million. So obviously a big potential market for these liquid staked Ethereum coins. Now this coin, it's not released yet, right? Unreleased token here, but also a confirmed airdrop that like no one is talking about right now. Now I personally deposited five ETH on there and I'm waiting patiently for the day that they release that token and I get my airdrop. Okay, that's it. Let me know what you think about all these down below in the comment section. I'll see you in the next video.